Well, and it's also a great day for a flight, actually. So that's, that's, yeah, go ahead. That, that's right. Yeah, the Eastern Iowa Honor Flight is celebrating a very special milestone. This is the 50th flight the organization has put together since operations first began back in 2009. KWWL's Lily Cedardall is live from the Eastern Iowa Airport now, and Lily's been there all morning long, and it just can like people continue and continue to arrive. We really like the last guy you spoke to, Lily. Yeah, the sense of camaraderie here is absolutely amazing. The Eastern Iowa Honor Flight has given over 4,400 veterans the opportunity to visit Washington, D.C.'s biggest memorials. And today, 88 more will join in on the same shared experiences. This morning, I am honored to be joined here by Mike Wilson, who is a World War II veteran and a sponsor of this 50th Honor Flight. Mike, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Oh, it's going to be a great day. I'm looking forward to it. So tell us, how does it feel to be here today? Of course, we've got all the veterans kind of flocking in now. So oh, kind good. of tell us a little bit about well, that. Well, it's a wonderful feeling. It's a wonderful feeling. And all these guys, and they're going to have a wonderful day, all of us together. And why are events like this important for all of the veterans? Well, it's so important to these veterans, and they get together with other friends. Another great advantage, a lot of the guardians are family members, like grandchildren, and they get tremendous communications. So it's a great experience all the way around. And of course, the big part is that you guys are able to share your experiences together during these flights as you guys are going to these memorials. So kind of what stories stick out from your personal experiences? I'm sure there's a few. Well, I suppose there's a few, but uh, I, I didn't get any real action, but I had a lot of experiences and I got on a ship and I got to sail in both the Atlantic and Navy, so um, Atlantic and Pacific, so I got my series of being seasick. Is there a specific memorial that you're looking forward to seeing today? Well, I've seen them before, but uh, I think uh, the World War II in, in Arlington and the changing of the guard is a really stimulating experience. Well, Mike, thank you so much for being here today. I really appreciate it, and I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day well, ahead. I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> of course, if you guys are interested at home in welcoming the veterans <laughs> as they come back this evening, you are welcome to do so. That flight is expected to land here at the Eastern Iowa Airport at 940. Of course, for more information, you can go ahead and go to our website at kwl.com. Live in Cedar Rapids, Elise Cedar Dawn, News 7, KWL.